Hi guys, greetings from Better Man Clinics and welcome to Ask the Expert, the segment of the program in which actual questions from our viewers and listeners are answered by the foremost experts in the field. Today's question comes from Oscar in Charlotte, North Carolina. Oscar asks, what's the difference between ITIND and other procedures for BPH like TERP and HOLIP? In order to answer Oscar's question, we turn to Dr. Dean Elterman, Associate Professor of Urology at the University of Toronto. Here was Dr. Elterman's explanation. Uh, it's entirely different. This is a completely different way of thinking about improving the flow through the prostate. So other types of procedures like you just mentioned are removing tissue. They're ablative or resective. In other words, we're actually cutting away removing tissue. Mm -hmm. What ITIND does, which is, and it stands, and remember, it's an acronym, Temporary Implantable Nitinol device, T-I-N-D. So what the ITIND is doing is it's actually creating these deep incisions or grooves into what's called the bladder, neck, and prostate by inserting this temporary device into that area. And what it does is it expands very slowly over a five to seven day period. And it creates these deep incisions or grooves into the prostate essentially opening up the prostate, in increasing the diameter of the passageway through the prostate without actually having to remove any tissue. So it's a cut-free way of improving flow. And so the eye tint, uh, I know we're on video, I'll try and hold one up here. All right, the eye tint is this little device with these struts, if you can see it there. Totally. And so, so there's one at uh, 12 o'clock, there we go, one at 12, one at five and seven. And the idea is that they expand up uh, at the 12, five and seven o'clock. And when it's left in place, it will create these deep grooves. And then after five, uh, seven days, the entire device is removed. There's nothing left over inside the prostate. This is not a permanent implant. It's not a permanent stent. It's just temporarily placed. 